thing you answered. I could probably use your help. Probably. Fine. I could really use your help. Can we meet? Just tell me when and where. You don't know how good it is to hear that. Swing by the Alde Caldo's camp. I'll explain it all. The Alde Caldo? Thought you parted ways. Look, it's a long story. Just hurry over. I'm here. Right, well, hello and welcome to episode 13 of Let's Play Cyberpunk 2077 with me, Hooch. We're not quite where we left the game. Um, that's because I recorded the whole of episode 13. And then when I went to press stop at the end, realised I hadn't pressed record. So I recorded uh, nothing. So I managed to find a auto save where we wasn't too far away from where we left off. But I could do an intro straight away because I knew that that phone call with Pan Am happened straight away when I did a couple of trials. So you've missed nothing, just me being an idiot, just means I've got to do this again. So we're going to meet with Takamura. I did also try and do a danger very high gig and everyone got red schools were red and I couldn't even take them down stealthily and they kicked my ass three times. <clears throat> so we'll put that in the bin for the time being. But let's go and do this Takamura thing. Now I'm not offering an action packed episode again, but I'm starting to become peace with the idea. But I don't think, like I said in the other episode, or it might have been the one that got deleted, this game isn't really a shooter from what I've made out now. It's a it's a, just a solid RPG with shooting elements rather than an FPS. Project yeah, that hasn't paid me yet. Oh, yeah. What's up? We've got a crisis on our hands. Really use your help. Oh, I can't be bothered. Break down. Nothing any shrink can do about it. Can you come here to the studio just to talk to him? Fine. I suppose. Sure. On my way. She said she'll come. Thanks, B. You didn't pay me for the last job. So I've decided, again, I don't know if I said this in the previous episodes or the one that got lost, but um, we, I'm not going to worry about getting the money together for that cyber day. We'll just play the game, I think, and do a couple of story missions and hopefully make some money that way. Or we could just have an episode where we look at the map and just go and do the stuff that's on the map. Quite fancy that actually. Let me know if there's anything you want in the comments. But, um, I don't think it's the most interesting game to watch myself, but that's me. Oh, we're nearly there. Come for a seedy meeting look with Takamura. Lean on the barrier. It is good to see you, B. Seems pretty uh, secluded here. It is appropriate for such a secret meeting. Friend you mentioned here? Oda? He should be here any moment now. Willing finally to give me the spec on him? He's Hanako-sama's bodyguard. Hanako Arasaka's? From the carrier at Anchor in the Bay? Saburo's daughter? Yes, and if he believes you, we'll next meet with her. And what's to stop her little errand boy from selling us out? He will not do that. He's a man of honor. Right, because Arasaka's ranks are chock full of those. 
Do not confuse true honor with the petty morals by which you live. By God, huh? a good sign. He is usually camouflaged. Well, our predator. Or like someone going to a Trump rally. I love the way you get that, see that little Johnny Silver hand. If you didn't rewind it there, as he parked, a flash like Brad Pitt in Fight Club. That's pretty cool. Oh, this geezer looks serious, you know. This is not going to go well. Takemura san, Oda. Is this her? Your thief. She's my witness, B. Can speak for myself, you know. So speak. I have been told you know things. Is there? Saw what happened. Yorinobu strangled the old guy. Silence! Not one word more. You will bring death to your door. But it is the truth. Hanako-sama must hear it. My one concern is to keep her safe. In this city forgotten by the gods. Is she in danger? Now? No. Yet during the parade to honor Arasaka sama, most certainly, I bring you this witness to his murder. And you dare to worry about the silly parade? Fool! Correct. Unlike you, I have not yet failed to keep my oath keep out of it. to do my duty. You will regret those words. The only thing I regret is that I came here to meet you. There is a price on your head. I do you a favor now by not cutting it off and taking it straight to your inabu sama. What would you do now? Were you in my place? I do no favors. I would deliver you ahead to your inabu sama. Consider yourself lucky that I am not you. Okay, enough, enough. You cannot be Hold up. It. What? We're talking about a guy who killed his father to seize control of Arasaka. Gonna take an interest in this or not? Yeah. I will not. Well, fuck off then. But I will let you leave this place, this city, unharmed. You'll try. If I see either of you again, I will not be so lenient. Yeah, well, I won't forget we've had this conversation. My friend. Dickhead. We are all so far from home. What a fucking prick. Good fucking riddance. Yes, what I'm One saying. Arasaka whack job is already plenty. No way this was gonna work. Mm. Yet, we walk away with a small measure of success. How do you... Uh, mm. How do you figure that? Yeah, do you figure that, dude? What Oda said. They returned to Tokyo after the parade. Do you not see that parade? It is our chance, perhaps, if somehow we can get to Hanako-sama. We must do a proper reconnaissance first. We'll need a precise map of Japan town. Hold on. It is your turn to call on friends. Do you know a fixer who could help? I'm not alone. Who's the fixer, Dame? Wakako Okada runs a pachinko parlor on Jig Jig Street. We must pay this woman a visit. Okay. Will you join me? Yes. Sure, why not? We're a passenger in a car again. Don't take a week to start it and get going, I like everybody else. So what are you doing? You're not putting your seatbelt on. You're not turning the ignition on. I see, come on. What is this name? <laughs> Just a night city name. Beware, you mock me too often. Oh, keep your fucking hair on. You alright, Goral? Yes. Why, Why is that a Oh, I did this last time I recorded it right. You go in this tunnel, there must be some sort of. Oh, well, let him speak first. Uh, just asking. Does everything with you have to have an ulterior motive? I apologize. That, that came off wrong. wrong. I am a 
I am simply not used to such questions. People like me, either we are doing well, or we are in a grave. Any idea what's going on at Arasaka? Only what I can surmise from what I see on TV. Yorinoba is his puppets, green at the cameras, and he insists that everything is under control. But the wider the spy, the bigger the lies. Okay, so it's finished now. So basically what I think has happened there is they've put in some programming to make noise echo in the tunnel. But it's not detailed enough to know it shouldn't echo if we're in a car with the window shut. And then the echo doesn't come off when you come out the tunnel. So he's going to keep echoing and echoing every time we talk to him. Not a game breaking bug. But there's a lot of bugs in it that seem to be just undercooked. I know the base consoles that's disgusting I, I can't defend that but I do think the game is getting a bit of an hard time on this on what I'm playing it on which is Series X anyway because so far I think it looks gorgeous I'm having a lot of fun with it but it just seems to be super undercooked are, are we nearly there now I think we're nearly there actually I'm just going to skip but if I remember rightly this is it this is the place but he couldn't drive it any slower, could he? You make sure you have a good run-up at that parking, mate. That's it. Oh, don't go too fast. All top parking. And he's going to taxi up a curb anyway, look. Night City. Right, we are far away. You ready? Come on, it's this way, mate. Crashed all the strip joints. And the sex shop with the big dildos and the strap-ons. I think we've looked at that before, haven't we? We'll have a look through the window. I mean, what? Look at the one with the fist on. Oh, my days. Got something that'll keep you wet, but I'll... Well, is it a bucket of water? You know what, big fella? I'm Rush, will you? Walks like he drives. Rogue, my sweet. This has got to be a misunderstanding. I've no idea who jumped your team, but the claws? No, never. My boys know their place. I, I, I'm sorry, got to go. I have guests. V. So nice to see you. And your charming friend is? Happen to be working together, that's all. Takemura Goro desu. Okada-san, oai dekite kohei desu. Ah, a true gentleman. Ah, shame only that he's being hunted by all Arasaka's tin soldiers. And you, V, bring him to my door. Give me one reason why I shouldn't notify the proper authorities right away. Eddie's is why. Always about Eddie's, Makako. You want to make them, we got this. Doesn't get any simpler. So tell me, and mark well I still have my phone at hand. Need intel on the parade that's scheduled to come through Japantown. So it's Arasaka. What I fail to understand is, why come to me? Did Mr. Deshawn not come to the phone? Arasaka, Tiger Claws, kind of like the family dog screwing the cat, hmm? Can't possibly be fond of the people who killed your grandkid. That was very long ago. Time's the best healer. Wound like that, though. A wound like that. No. Everything's on the shards. How much does this cost? My pockets are empty. Clearly. My gift to you, it's free. Nothing's free. Okada-san, what is free often proves most costly? What he said. Gonna take them or not?
Japan Town. Whole district is to be sealed off for the parade. Dashi Platforms, the main attraction. They'll fly this way, high above street level. Along the parade route, balconies, footbridges, and vantage points affording good views. Hanako Arasaka, a guest of honor, will deliver her speech from the largest float. She'll do this exactly here. Got no idea about security, but given recent events, expect it to be tight. Our last parade? Arasaka undercovers infiltrated the crowd. Not to mention a smattering of sharpshooters, drones. And if that's not enough fun for one day, a net runner, one at least. They use the city CCTV to observe everything. Main access point, here. It's an old automated control center. If you ask me, most useful by far. At the end, the floats will float out of Japan Town, and we'll be left with trash up to our elbows that no one will collect. That's it. It's all I have. It must be enough. Then go. Be on your way. Okay. Thanks, Bukako. We appreciate this, Okada-san. Delightful, mature woman. This information, it could be just what we need. But I will try to investigate further. I will stay here some time and call some associates. The moment I learn something new, I will let you know. Stay safe, Goro. You as well. Until next time. Okay, right. That's that done. Got something that'll keep you wet, but I'll... What's he doing there? I mean, what are these places? Shards everywhere. Watson Hall diary. Oh no, she's real. I thought it was a hologram. Where's your cute little ass rushing off to? Who's someone talking to me? Treat yourself to a little R E L A X. Sorry, mate, was in your way. Could get pissed. Ah, sticky in. Is that geezers dancing in the window and everything? Oh my god man, it's just fucking Pat Pong Street. Okay, so what we're gonna do next. Last time I started a side mission. That was quite boring. Uh, I know it gets to be interesting later, I think. But, um, just want to round the episode off. You know what? Let's start at the bottom. So, we've got these fights, but I'm pretty sure that's the best way to lose money because I did have a little go, obviously. I said, Let's, it's not the second playthrough, but I did start the game and then start it again. I did a few missions. Um, I'm going to kick some ass kicked in them. I can't do the cyber psychos yet. Beat on the back, beat on the back. Happy to get that. What's this? Ah, the neighbour, which is in the same place as the shooting range thing. So, I'm going to get that out of the way, I think. And we need a vehicle. That'll do. So we'll just try and fill the episode up. It's not going to be a long episode today. Because the wife could come back at any minute and spring me because I'm supposed to be doing something. I'm so pissed off was I last night when I lost that episode at the end. Come here. Del? Virus in my core. Damaged. And we've got another mission there for Delavane as well, so we've got plenty of side missions. Oh, 
And we ought to go and see that brain dance murderer thing again, haven't we? Because we ain't gonna paid for the first, but yeah, I want my money. Oh, well, that was a thing there. How do we get up there? That's another thing we need to get away. We need to talk to Misty, but I did say I'd do that once I got the money together to pay back big time. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I didn't mean to kill anybody. Yeah, it was an accident. Sorry. I said I was sorry. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, it was an accident. Fucking hell. If someone admits that they're wrong, it's an accident. Do you still need to fucking shoot him? How far have I got to run to get rid of this star now? Oh, for fuck's sake. Is everyone gone? Thank you. And then when it, and then when the stars are gone, everybody comes back. It's little things like that, isn't it, man, they haven't. But to be fair to them, you know, They've bit off more than they can chew it now. They've tried to create <clears throat> Oblivion, Skyrim, Fallout, Deus Ex, and GTA all in the same fucking game. Sweet, oh, we haven't been home for ages. What's in the tele body implants? What's the news? Try your vegetable. Oh, so we have a mission there. Let's go and talk to this Barry bloke. Hey Barry, everything all right in there? I'm gonna take that as yes. Try again later. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. <sighs> okay, so that was a waste of our time, but we'll do this. Got a mission here. Shoot to three up. Hey, about to start. You, uh, <clears throat> gotta take a piss or something? Uh, now's the time. Thanks for your concern. Let's start Let's just get road. going. <laughs> Can't just yet. Not till you get in the range. Go on, set up, chop chop. Free ammo. Free ammo. Free ammo. <clears throat> Alrighty, how many we got? Just six? God damn. Well, no point crying about it. <clears throat> Rules are simple, right? There's the target, shoot him. No matter which one, go on and shoot your neighbors. Most hits win. Uh, meaning hits on the target, not your neighbor. Oh, right. Uh, small caliber iron only. Don't go showing off with your fucking assault bangers or no rocket pukers. Got me? First prize is a pistol. But, uh, 
A, a real nice one. It's fucking nice, I'm telling you. Anyway, uh, up for it. Warmed up. Ready? Three. Two. Hey, hey! The hell's that? The hell are you doing with that double barrel? Is that small caliber only? Uh, forgot my iron. Must be in my other jacket. That's where you keep your gun in the holster. A holster! Get the fuck out of my sight, now! Fuck, Chum. Chill. I'm going. I'm going. Pearls before swine, for fuck's sake. All right. Three. Two. What we cheating? I got a smart weapon. I don't think the smart things are looking if I'm honest with you. Look at you, Rudy. Go, go, go. Halfway there, Pete. Get a grip for fuck's sake. Yeah, well, I didn't know this was not going to work, this gun, did I? Also, I've just got a proper gun I could aim on the sights on. You ass, so they couldn't even aim down my iron sights. All right. What weapon? Understood. Got it. Sure. I want to go home. Sweet. Thanks, Wilson. Ah, sure is pretty. Uh -huh. Yeah. Hey, you okay? <laughs> Something wrong? Ain't a damn thing that's right. Contest didn't do shit. Didn't sell a goddamn thing. Nothing. Should try not calling potential buyers Bush League. Yeah, maybe, but... Fuck! Got something you gotta respect. If you don't know how to shoot, don't do it! Ugh. Take care of me. I'll see you around. Yeah, can I suggest buying a vest that fits, mate? Well, let's check out this gun. Ooh, it's nice, you know. Ricochet, chemical damage. It's not smart link, but it's a nice pistol. He was right. Right then, I am gonna call that the, we'll get on the lift first, what we do at the outro, at the end of the episode, I think. Just a short one, just a half an hour. So the wife could be back at any minute, but at least we know we've got number 13 recorded. So again, not the most interesting, didn't shoot a bullet in anger. But like I say, it's an RPG I think, and we're just going to have to play it for the story and the characters. So, thanks for watching. Leave a like if you like. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. This is where you'll find me on Twitch. This is where you'll find me on Twitter. And until next time, to Arabic.